What is the people? This is why I searched you and in this video I'll be showing you how to download and install ethos on a USB drive along with how to check its checksum. So let's get started. This is the downloads page from where you'll be downloading ethos. And before you go onto this page, the first thing one has to do is buy ethos. So let's just click on buy ethos and open its link. This opens up GPU Shacks page. These are the three variants in which you can buy ethos. One is the digital download, the other is the 16 GB USB, and the third one is the 16 GB ethos SSD. Now both the USB and the SSD come flashed with ethos. Also, you could you can buy the MOBO CPU RAM ethos bundle from GPU Shack. And these two come with ethos. So you won't have to buy ethos extra if you buy the bundles. So now if we come back to the downloads page, you should read the ethos license agreement because all these points are crucial and it would help you. So just after reading it all, just click on the tick box and then download it. Now this would ask for a username and password. So for this, you will have to go to the email that you got from GPU Shack. If you don't see this email in the regular inbox, just check in spam. So th this is the email that you will get. The things that you'll have to do is click on the download link and copy and paste the username and password that you get. And that would start the download. Now the good thing about this is that it would select the download server based on your location. And mine was Bangalore, so it selected that. Now while this download is happening, let's talk about the G GPL license agreement. To be fair, I've seen a lot of things on the internet regarding ethos, but most of all of them were fake. And people just wanted to use this OS without paying for it. This is the source page and over here you will find the SHA-256 checksum and the MD5 checksum. These both will be necessary to check the checksum or the integrity of the download. So we'll first let the download complete. Now the download is complete. So we'll just open up the folder, paste the download link over here. Next we'll do, the first thing that I'll do is check the checksum. So we'll just right click on it and click on the SHA-256 button. Now that would be available if you install 7-zip. So now let's just compare both the SHA-256 numbers and both are equal and hence we will just extract the .exe file. This might take some time to unpack. and the extraction is complete. So the thing that we'll do again is click on CRC SHA, check the SHA-256 checksum and compare it with the source page again. Now let's compare the checksum again. So these both match.
now that that's done we'll go to the next part that is writing the dot img file on a usb drive so the recommended method is using hdd raw copy so we'll just open up the software then double click on the source file there's this one my computer is just working slow so bear with me please and then we'll just select the .img file don't select the .exe file we need the .img file then click on continue then select the so uh, the destination that is the usb drive and click on continue and then just press start when you press start don't interrupt the process or it might even destroy your usb drive that is the first method now the next me method is using hr.io so we'll just open up hr.io now this software i like the software because of the gui especially these are all the features that it provides but keep in mind that this software only works with usb drives that has been my experience next the th thing that i like about this is that it works on all three platforms windows mac and linux so i'll just download the windows version and i like portable software so hence i'll just do uh, i downloaded the portable one and it opened so we will just select the image file again there is a dot img one then it would auto detect the usb drives if you have multiple connected then you can select any one and then just click on flash that's it this is the most simple process that one can do so that sums up this video so thank you people for watching this video like this video or dislike it subscribe to the channel share it go through my other videos and see you next time tada